So as we close, the next, the last question really is to um, is to give you an opportunity to give closing remarks. <laughs> you know, to you 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 recently turned forty one. You know, <gasps> yes, you, you I turned have... forty one in my bed, <laughs> feeling sad <laughs> and uh, broken because my father was not here to. He will always send me some money for my birthday. <laughs> and it's not even the money, it's just a thought for, ah, hiya, it is your birthday today. Like he doesn't remember. So I'm grateful that uh, the family gave me that space to mourn and cry and think, yeah. So I recently turned 41, hmm. believe it or not. I know I look 30. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a new season. Hmm. Uh, as always, so if you're, you know, you never give a politician and a pastor one minute yeah. because they say in conclusion, mm. as I come to an end. Mm. We have battery life, <laughs> right? We so, have battery life. Yeah, so you, so you have your, mo you have, have you have your minute. I have, here's my minute. <laughs> yeah. So. Um, I still don't look at you as a politician. I, I still uh, look at you as uh, as All right, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, if you're in Moranga, mm. you're a professional or a young professional, it doesn't matter what work you're doing. Um, first, tell your people about me that they need to vote for me. Number two, you need to be a registered voter. And if certain bills pass, that means you can only nominate your candidate if you're registered in your candidate's uh, party. So think think through through that as well. Um, and definitely people of Moranga, whether professionals or uh, current people living in Moranga, I need your votes. I, I don't want them. I need them. Um, so that we can, you know, I've been saying my, my politics are, you know, just one jeki. When a, like an ambassador comes in, just for the next step, mm. you know, so that we go to the next step because we are hardworking, we are smart, we are resilient. Um, so that just one push, and we can be able to do that. Um, so my five uh, main pillars, mm -hmm. or what we we'll call my manifesto for Moranga, mm -hmm. and I pray to spill over. Mm nation into global mm. wide is one education yeah. which is a sustainable goal or sdg number four mm. to ensure that every morang every moranga child mm -hmm. gets to school in a dignified way clean mm. uniform mm. that the education you're getting is quality efficient and effective mm. that education you have access to education lifelong Wherever you want to learn, you'll always have, mm. uh, as it is, we only have one university mm. in Moranga. We have a couple of uh, TVET and mm. polytechnics. Mm. But imagine if we had like a science mm. uh, university, mm. you know? Mm. And because the, the, the city is a, is, a, is a Senate seat, it's in Parliament, mm. is to push for those policies, mm -hmm. like you're saying. Mm to ensure schools have that. I mean, we've had a challenge of education for mm. a long time. Mm. And it's inclusive, whether you're a teen mom, mm. a young mom, mm. or an older person who missed education at a certain point, mm. you can come back and, mm. and learn. Mm. And it's not just classroom mm. learning. Mm. There's development learning as well. How do you keep your environment around you sustainable, mm. even for yourself? So mm. that is um, one of my pillars. Right. Right. Secondly, mm -hmm. economic empowerment, right. which is uh, SDG 5, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and that means um, offering opportunities, equal mm -hmm. opportunities to both boys and girls, mm -hmm. uh, wherever uh, they are in Moranga. Mm -hmm. I mean, definitely giving uh, capital mm -hmm. as well as part of that mm -hmm. uh, for, to start businesses. Mm -hmm. Um, for table banking ideas to women mm -hmm. in groups. You'll be surprised the number of women groups in Moranga. Mm. There's something about community. So you see, mm. everything is fitting in together. Mm -hmm. uh, table banking, access to government funds like WESO, uh, we, uh, the Women Empowerment uh, Funds, um, giving that to youth mm. and um, women or uh, marginalized communities, disabled people also getting uh, similar uh, access and opportunities as well. 
um, ending early marriages, mm. teen pregnancies mm. is also a big deal under uh, under that for me. So mm. Mm. yeah, fantastic. And then um, health mm -hmm. as a third pillar. As a third pillar. And SDG three. SDG three. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, opportunities mm. for proper well-being healthcare for all. yeah healthcare for all universal mm. healthcare i think mm. it's a good plan mm. um i've had a lot of governors saying there's access to nhif especially for families that cannot uh, afford it mm. afford afford health mm -hmm. think through uh, reducing maternal um, mortality mm. or infant deaths mm. and that can only be done if our hospitals are well equipped mm -hmm. um, the the doctors and nurses are well motivated mm. Um, and they have, they have what? What the equipment that they need? Mm, the it's sad. I mean, we've walked around and we hear people saying, "Yes, we'll go to a certain hospital, we'll see a doctor, but you cannot even get paracetamol, mm. paracetamol." So mm. that 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 conversation has to change. Mm. But I'm very keen on also mental health. Mm. I mean, I, I think Moranga has maybe some very scary statistics mm. about. Mm. Our people are not well, mm -hmm. and we are not talking about yeah, that. Yeah. You it know, it's one of the highest burdens in the, in the country. Yeah, when it comes to yeah, mental health. yeah, and we're not talking about it, yeah. and that again affects yeah. family, which later affects governance. Yeah, you know, yeah. and so it's we need to be well. For, uh, uh, gender. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. It's we a cause. Leading suicide cases for both women and men in from Moranga. Uh, the the disparity in terms of uh, mental health yeah. in Moranga is 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 uh, skyrocketing. Yeah. yeah. So have uh, be able to promote that. You mm. know, would it be centers, art centers, mm. just uh, equip rehabilit the current rehabilitation centers, mm. uh, talk with and uh, empower young moms. You know, just mm. that your well being is okay. okay. It's not what you tell people; mm. it's how you make them. Feel. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, what's the fourth one? Okay. So that's SDG thirteen, mm -hmm. which is on climate uh, change. I'll call it climate action. All so right. now, end. Mm -hmm. My end is on climate action, okay. and like I said previously, on the eighth of uh, January, just to celebrate my forty-first birthday, mm -hmm. planted over seven hundred uh, seedlings mm -hmm. of bamboo, mm -hmm. and we hope we can do more across mm -hmm. past the arid areas of. Mm -hmm. Imagine Moranga having and continue. Arid areas. Imagine. Do you know that 2019 mm. was the second warmest year mm -hmm. recorded since I think is it 1895? Oh wow. Second warmest. It was the hottest. Second hottest in 2019. Mm. And uh, in the decade it was the hottest decade between what is that 2009 10 mm. to 2019 mm. because of greenhouse uh, gases mm. uh, carbon monoxide mm. increased carbon monoxide mm. the other hottest year was 2016. Mm. so you can imagine if that's going to be a pattern that mm. every three After years every then three the next years. one is and then probably we, we have the frequency starts decreasing if we do mm. the right thing mm. if we do what is right mm. you know plant our trees take care of our mm. environment mm. um and, you know it's sad that we have catchment areas in Moranga, in mm. the Kaine Dam, mm. that will surpass Moranga mm. and bring water to Nairobi. Nairobi. Yeah. Uh, and yet the people don't have, don't even have an idea of what tap water is. Mm. In places like where I come from, mm. where we have dug, maybe the most privileged people have dug like boreholes, mm. or if the county government has dug boreholes, mm. the water is so salty. Mm. That means it will affect your teeth. You can't even drink it. You still mm. are in pursuit of mm. hot water. I visited uh, a police station mm -hmm. and unfortunately, mm -hmm. all they want is a water tank so that they can store mm. their, their water. So people are willing to take up a climate action mm. Um, for and climate change for reasons. climate, mm. yeah. Mm. Uh, but sometimes we are not, we are not ready. Mm. We are not. You know, someone once said, if human beings became extinct, you'd be surprised to see just how beautiful the earth will regenerate mm. uh, to what God intended it mm. to be. Mm. So we are our greatest threat to the environment. Mm. So uh, places I've been, we are receptive. So we now want to do it at a county 
uh, county level. Mm. Yeah, again, because my leadership of my politics mm. are transgenerational. Mm. Mm. And finally, mm -hmm. uh, SDG 8, mm -hmm. uh, which is on dignified work. Mm -hmm. So for me, it's dignified work. Mm. Uh, offering full and productive work mm. to to the residents mm. or the citizens mm. of mm. Uranga County, mm. uh, supporting with SMEs, mm. innovation. We are too quick mm -hmm. to kill uh, innovation in this country mm. or in Africa mm. at large. Mm. Um, we have many graduates, mm. and I, I think one of the leaders is quoted saying, if your university churns out X graduates and you thrive and you're happy in saying they are roasting maize, then you, there's something that you're missing, yeah, you know? Yeah, or the way we'll say we are offering work, mm. but we're asking our graduates, our graduates to mm. clear sewers. Mm. Uh, what sweep the streets? I mean, we are wasting a lot of labor in the in intellectual mm. uh, property mm. intelligence. Uh, so I I want to do that. You know, build a database. Mm. Um, have have everyone listed there. Be able to share it with MCAs mm. and say this is it. Or do you have a contracting job? Mm. I have the perfect engineer for you. Mm. You and just network. So, you know. so as I listen to those five, one of the things that stands out for me is that um, the women, the woman rep seat, it's woman rep, right? Yes, it's woman rep because mm. you're a woman who is representing. Mm. You're not rep you're not a women mm. rep mm. because you're not just representing mm. women. Women. So this woman rep seat and the vision or the manifesto mm. that you're sharing here is is larger than just women. Yes, it is larger than so and that's a demis that's something i'm and the reason i'm posing here or rather bringing it up bookmarking it here is that you know from a lot of when when it is thought about yes with for for for, for many people they just think oh that um that's a position for just women it's women who will vote uh, no it will be just women no. issues the things the five things that you've education health um uh, climate change uh dignified work and i think mm. uh, i forget the fifth one mm. those five issues are all cross-cutting mm. they cut across family they cut across communities mm. they cut across gender mm -hmm. they are across you know everything everything mm -hmm. so as you share this mm. um out to you know uh, the people who are watching the people who should take mm. action mm. and as you even give out your call for action mm. you're not just giving out a call for action mm. to women mm. you're giving a call to action to the people, people yeah. of muranga and the other thing about this is also it's not just a position for muranga Mm. It is a position for the country. For the country, you are a woman rep in Muranga, but you sit at a national level, yes. influencing policy. Yes, at, this at level. a national level. Yeah, yeah. So, but I have to sell vision because Muranga is fifty-two percent women, uh, forty-eight percent men. Mm. So I have to sell vision to this fifty-two percent mm. because they carry majority of the votes mm -hmm. and if they buy buy, buy my vision mm. then mm. it's easy that means in an electorate of maybe 800 uh, a thousand mm. there's quite some numbers mm. sorry i didn't do much major in mm. this time mm. so <laughs> but yeah so you need to convince these people because then they go and preach and there's a quote when to empower a woman mm. you empower a whole village mm. just one woman can change a whole mm. a whole place mm. yeah look at wangare mazai <laughs> yes then look at me <laughs> and because i have people who can vouch for me my husband mm. i always say if you're in somewhere and your family is not supporting you mm. there is an issue mm. so they say if you want to go fast go alone if you want to go further go with others my name is Wethera kibinda and i'm privileged to be on development dynamics with the expert himself, Mr. Maxi Eric Gitao. So netizens, citizens of the world, uh, development professionals, uh, development uh, specialists, this is my story about going far and farthest with others on Development Dynamics with Maxi.